Good morning, everybody. Uneducated economist here. So get this, I got the wildest news yesterday. It turns out that Chase Bank has let all the credit card debt go in Canada. That's right. Canadians are getting letters saying that they do not owe the debt that they have taken out on their credit cards from Chase. They just let it go. And, the, and these people are just like, they're just floored by it. They're absolutely in disbelief that they have like, this all the all the late fees all the interest payments everything it's all gone they don't owe a single dime to chase they're saying hey guys you're good don't worry about it and i got to thinking what in the world is going on no way in the world did the bank do this as a gift okay no way in the world did that happen this was a deal there was a deal that went down and I can't tell you what it is because it, it, the, the news articles on it are not very clear on how big of a deal this was and what the, it, it's not clear. It, it's just like they basically just said, hey, we're done, we're done. And uh, we, we, don't, we, don't need to, we don't need you guys to pay the money back. We're gonna write it off. And everybody is just so, like I said, the people who had this happen to them, they're jumping up and down. It's like, you know, one of those like things that you never hear about, right? It's like kind of like winning the lottery. And I got to thinking about this, you know, it's not just that you don't have to pay the credit card back. You guys, these Canadians, they have been cut off from access to credit. That's the bigger story here, okay? Because think about it, if you have an economy out there, it's based on how much access to credit you got. And a great chunk of Canadians have just had a credit line taken away. Think about that. Anyway, thought that was a very interesting story. I got to go to work. Talk to you guys later.